Midoriya was hit by an animal quirk, turning him into a dog. He was adopted by Bakugao without knowing that it was Midoriya. On call. What now brat? Have you seen Deku? He's not in my house. What are you talking about? I sent him home a few hours ago. So you sent him when I was still at my duty? Wasn't that what I'm doing normally? I sent him back at 8pm as usual. Why do you sound like you blaming me brat? I'm not blaming you old hag. It's just that I can't find him. I've been calling his name but he is not really here. Jesus, have you asked your neighbors? Not yet. But you're planning to ask them right? Right fine. Okay, go ask them. They're your former classmates. Don't be shy to ask for help from them about looking for your pet. I'm not ashamed to ask those extras. His mom hung up. The next day, Bakugao went to Kirishima's house that was also located in the same subdivision as him. Oh, hi Bakabro. What brings you here? Deku is missing. What happened? Didn't you drop him off to your mom's house yesterday? Well, yes. She said that she sent him home but when I arrived he's not there. Oh my god, where could he be right now? Maybe we should call our friends for some help too. You mean you're gonna tell raccoon eyes, tape, and dun's face about this? Yes, why not? Isn't it normal for friends to help each other kind of face? No, they're just going to make things messier. Someone knocks on the door. Hey what are you saying? You're not letting us help? Because we'll get things messy? Do you think we're that dumb? What the far how did you three get in front of the fine door? We're about to go here. We even texted you to go as well. Don't tell me you didn't read Mina's text. Oh, I forgot my phone since I'm panicking of where to find Deku. Your dog? Yes. Got any problem with my dog tape face? It's not like that. I'm just surprised because you seem to not like him before, you don't even pet him that much. Realizing that I just said something that I don't usually say kind of faces. That's none of your business. He's still my dog even if I don't want him to be clingy. That's what I thought as well. You used to hate pets didn't you? Look at that character development kind of face. Shut up. And Deku is the only pet that changed your view about pets. If Deku is a person he would be your first love for sure. What the far you extras are thinking that about a dog? Dang that's disturbing I'm gonna puke kind of faces. Don't get me wrong. I'm just comparing him to a person. I'm not shipping you to your dog the far. That's just disgusting kind of face. Hahaha <laughs> I would love to see a person that can make Bakabro fall in love and can change his perspective in life. I know right. He still haven't changed since high school. He still hates love life. Shut up your mouths. We're talking about the dog. How did I become the topic? Fine fine. Let's go look for him then. I'm going to print missing posters. Denki go post it on the internet since you have the most followers. Got it. We're going to ask around the subdivision. Just meet us in the front gate when you're done printing the papers. Yes I'm going to follow immediately. Don't forget to lock my door and gate when you left man. Got it. They asked around but no one saw Deku. Are you sure he's not in your house bro? I wouldn't be here if I hadn't inspected the house carefully and found nothing. Oh, we're about to reach the last house near the entrance gate. We only asked the houses neighboring Bakabro's house so there is also a possibility that he went to the other areas of the subdivision. You're right but I feel like he's not inside the subdivision anymore. What are you, a psychic? Maybe he is. Anyway, I posted a picture of Deku and said that he's missing. I got about a thousands of shares already. Who would have thought that a guy like you will be famous? You should be thanking me right now instead of insulting me you know. I'm not insulting you, but it's a fact that you're a slowpoke. My heart was broke by my so called friend kind of faces. Thanks though. I love this friend he's grateful kind of faces. His face says everything. Hey. I'm done with the printing. That's quick. Let's finish posting these so we can have Deku back immediately. Yes thanks. Oh my god, you're super welcome bro. Give me a hug. Huh? Oh I get your hands away from me oh I. It's so rare to hear you thank someone. 
Deku must be really important to you huh? True. I know right. He loves his pet so much I'm gonna cry. File if I'm not dealing with you all I am so happy he's a better person now kind of faces. But aren't you a better person now though? In Deku's location. In the ferry boat. Todoroki, isn't this the dog you're talking about last year? Ah, yes. He looks exactly like the dog that me and Bakugao fought over. The dog barked. Oh, what if this is Bakugao's dog? Why did you think so? Gut feeling? He got excited when he heard Bakugao's name. If this is Bakugao's dog and is missing, Bakugao or his friends would have immediately called for help. Todoroki, we're in a ship and there's no signal here. Are you telling me that they perhaps called us and we didn't receive it because there's no mobile network? Yes, this dog really looks familiar. If that was the case, then the dog will be with us for two days. I thought this is your dog that's why I brought him in when I saw him on the deck. It's fine. We can just contact them when we arrived at the location. Give me the dog first. He hasn't eaten right? Yes, you should feed him. I'm going to my room. It's almost night time. Todoroki brought Deku in his room. Just sit there okay? I'm going to prepare you some food. He's an angel with the beauty of God. You're so cute. He pets Deku. Oh my god Kachin's hot but this man's so pretty and handsome and intimidating as heck. Did I just think of Kachin again? Jeez, I should keep in mind that I'm mad at him because he's being so mean to me. Here, eat your food. I'm sure you were hungry. Holy crap. I'm going to try my best not to faint from this man's gorgeousness to avoid embarrassing myself. Your barking sound is cute too. And you're welcome. Enjoy your food. He's indeed perfect. And I knew it, my bark's not really ugly. That scrotum porcupine head anger issues man just got no taste. How dare he tell me that my bark was ugly. I thought about him again. As soon as Midoriya finished his meal, Todoroki cleaned his plate and served him a clean water. Hey, I'm going outside. Do you want to come with me? Midoriya refused and ran towards the bed. I see, you don't want to take a rest then. I would want to but it's cold outside. I don't have any clothes. News flash. Pro hero Midoriya has been missing for almost 4 months now. Everyone's losing hope about the hero's life. They're still looking for me huh? Well, the dank work is not wearing off. Todoroki. Why is he making that expression? I want to see him already. He turned his head to Midoriya. Do you think we can find him here? Here? What's he saying? Hold up, don't tell me they're going to find me in the neighboring countries. Get enough sleep now. I'm going outside. Todoroki pets his head. In the morning. Hey, wake up. You need to eat your breakfast before we leave the hotel. Hotel? We're in a hotel? When did we arrive? Here. I'm sorry, this is the only food in the hotel. I'm glad that he's not feeding me a dog food. I'm not a dog. Eat well. We're leaving to find Midoriya here after you eat. He pets Deku. So I'm right, they went in the neighboring country to find me. I feel bad. Dang this quirk. Todoroki. Please open the door. You need to see this. Okay wait. You don't need to yell. Oh sorry. I don't know but why is this making me nervous? I feel bad about this. Look. Todoroki and Ida looked at each other. So this dog is back your gals? Yes, just like what we assumed yesterday. Fine then. Should we send him home? No, let him stay here for now. It's not like we can't take care of him. And it will be a hassle to send him back when we just arrived. Let's go now. We need to continue in finding Midoriya. I don't know how to speak Korean though and the tour guide hasn't arrived yet. Let's just wait in the lobby then. In Bakugao's location. I can't believe that we're in Korea all of a sudden. Thanks to Deku-kun. Are you guys sure that Deku's here though? What if the stranger's lying? Let's trust him for now. We've got no idea either. And I think he's not an idiot to lie about something like this. True and he said that he saw Deku went inside the ferry. His description matched Deku's appearance too. Hey bro. Why did you name your dog after Midoriya? 
It's because they're both dumb. That's rude. He's always rude huh? Anyway let's check into a hotel. I'm too tired from riding the ferry. Same here. I want to connect to the hotel's internet and check my followers response about Deku. Where shall we start searching? It's best to inform the police first. They can help us, Bakugal. Huh. What the fuck are you two here? What a coincidence. We're searching for Midoriya. What about you guys? We're searching for Deku. What did I just see right there kind of shocked face? Mina saw Deku at the back of Ida, carrying him with a bag. Is that Deku? Ah yes. I almost forgot. We found him in our ship. You sure you're not planning to steal him? Bakugou glared at Todoroki. I'm not planning to do that. And weren't you the one who took him away from me even though I found him first in that shop? So what are you trying to say? Nothing. I just don't want to dirty my name with your accusations. Come here Deku. Let's go back. Oh, so you named him after Midoriya? That's ironic, considering that you hate Midoriya that much that you're not even showing your concern when he went missing. What do you know about my thoughts? You're not sure if I care or not. Don't your actions show that you don't? You, stop it you two. We're at the lobby. Don't argue here. Thank you for letting Deku stay with you. We've been looking for him since yesterday. I'm sorry for my friend's attitude, he is just an ungrateful bitch sometimes kind of faces. I saw Kim and Ari's tweet just now so we didn't get to inform you immediately. Why don't we join them in looking for Midoriya since we found Deku already? I like the idea. Same here. Hey you want to stay because Todoroki's here aren't you? Don't talk about that when he's near us. He might hear it. I think I overheard something I shouldn't hear kind of faces. Bakugou is now holding Midoriya and is talking to him. Why did you even leave the house Dumbus? It's not like you to leave when I'm not there. Deku didn't bark nor wag his tail. So you're sulking huh? Bakugou hugged him. I'm sorry okay? I'm sorry for not coming home early to feed you. I've been busy with Deku's case. That Dumbus is still missing until now. Aren't Todoroki and Ida the in charge with the case? And I also apologize for being mad at you often when I'm tired from work. Ah, yes. I remember, he used to treat me better in the first few weeks after he adopted me from that shop. So the reason why he was being mean to me these past few weeks was because he was stressed out from finding the human me? Now I want to come back immediately. I don't know how long the quirk will last though. After the whole day of searching, they didn't find any lead about Midoriya. In the hotel. In Bakugou's room. You stink Deku. Let's go to the bathroom. I'll wash you. It's cold though but it's better than being stinky isn't it? Why are you hesitating? I'm not going to bathe you with cold water Dumbus. Oh he's being thoughtful now huh? Midoriya went inside the bathroom. His hair is so soft. So cute. He definitely resembles Deku's hair. Far. I'm thinking of Deku again. What's he thinking? He was being quiet ever since he started washing me. There you go. You're done now, you can hop on the bed. Bed? Am I going to sleep in the same bed with him? Just stay here. I'm going to take a bath too. Don't run away from me ever again. He puts Deku on the bed. That's rare. He never lets me lie on his bed before. After a few moments, Bakugou went out from the bathroom. He's so hot. Bakugou removed his towel so Midoriya immediately turned around to avoid looking. I kinda want to take a peek but I'm scared. What am I even thinking? Taking a peek? I'm not a perv. Oh why are you sleeping? Why are you hiding in the sheets? Bid you literally X in front of me. You will suffocate if you don't come out. The sheets are thick. Gosh I know at this rate that he's smiling while looking at me fondly. My heart keeps skipping a beat. I wish he smiled at me when I was a human too. Bakugou lifted the sheets. You really act like Deku too you know. Are you perhaps him? Midoriya flinched. Ha, what am I even thinking? The damn Deku's driving me insane. Why don't he just come back? So Kachin cares for me, I want to come back and hug him. Move a little Deku. Let's sleep now. Midoriya can't help it but to scan Bakugou's body. 
The man's muscles are moving visibly as he lifts the sheets up while preparing to lie down. He's only wearing his boxers. Midoriha gulps. He's so hot. He's flying hot. Bakugou pets Midoriya's head again before he closed his eyes. I'm so touched I'm going to cry kind of face. Sleep well Deku. You too. Sleep well Kachin. 4.30 AM. Ugh what's this heavy feeling around my waist? Kachin's hugging me. Hugging my waist? Aunt I dog, why do I have a waist? Oh my fucking god I realized and have made a conclusion to everything now kind of face. I'm back into being a human. Holy shiz I'm not wearing any clothes on fg what should I do? Oh my god. Bakugou moved. Far, I'm doomed. Is he awake? I'm scared I'm just going to close my eyes and wait for miracle kind of face. Cold? So he's not awake. Thank god. I should leave the bed immediately. Midoriya was about to sit up but Bakugou wrapped his arms around tighter, making the man lie down again. It's cold. I should accept my fate and embarrass myself once he wakes up and find me lying next to him. It's not like it was my fault that I am in his bed. He was the one who keeps hugging me tightly. Ah, a firing alarm shut up will you aaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Really? Then why did you need to argue with Todoroki just to get me in the shop before? I'm getting the main character vibe here kind of face. Fine. I adopted that dog because it reminds me of you damn it. And also, why did you name him after me? Same reason. Okay. Holy shit I didn't expect that kind of face. Bakugao finally looked at Midori after calming down. Why are you smiling? I I think I like you Kachin. Crap, I said my thought out loud. I hope he doesn't get mad kind of face. Midori covered his face as he playfully snuggled on Bakugao's shoulder. Why are you covering your face? Ha. Huh. Midori looks up and got embarrassed again so he covered his face immediately. He's gorgeous. Mumbles you're asking me that, of course I'll get embarrassed. I just confess to you. I'm just saying just in case you didn't get it Deku, lift up your head and look at me. I want you to tell me that you like me while looking at me in the eye. Kachin's blushing. So, will you not tell me? Mumbles oh. Kachin to be honest, I've been admiring you since we were kids I like every gesture you make I like how you take care of things in your own way. Deku, I just want you to tell me that you like me because I already know all of those shiz you've been telling me those almost ever. Why are you yelling? I want you to tell me that you like me so that I can kiss you already. Why are you reacting like that? Isn't that the normal thing to do when you have mutual feelings? Midori closed his eyes. Give me 5 seconds for mental preparation. Ha. Ah. You already did naughty things to me just a few moments ago but you're scared of a kiss? How weak. You ready now? Yes. Back your gal's hands are shaking as he gently holds Midoriya's face and kissed him. I love you Deku. Love? Yes. I can continue loving you right? What kind of question is that? Of course you can. And that means we're a couple now. Bakugao laughed. In Kamanari's room. Hey Bakubro left and he said he's going to find Midoriya by himself. That's weird. I thought he doesn't care. Thinking about his nature, he surely cares. He's probably wrecking his head off until now because we haven't found Midoriya. Siro is panting as he went inside Kamanari's room. Man you won't believe what I just saw what happened. Bakubro left with someone. Faces that don't understand what's going on but are still shocked by the tea anyway. 7 hours later. While the Baka squad is eating, Todoroki knocked on Kamanari's room. Guys, Bakugao texted me that he found Midoriya. Baka squad gave each other an I knew it kind of faces. Oh, that's a good news. I pretend I didn't know what's happening. Yes, continue eating continue eating Todoroki is too pure for this kind of tea. That's actually very nice. I agree. Why they don't look surprised at all. Shall we go see them? That's a bad idea my dear. Midoriya is probably crying right now. Why would he cry? Because he is probably thankful. Right. And Bakugao's is probably panting RN. Panting because he's tired from running around the town to find Midoriya of course. Face that is glaring to Mina to stop her unholiness. Todoroki, let's go outside now. Come with me, I'll treat you anything. Oh, okay. Let's go then. Um, treating someone while being alone together. This is a date right? You can't call it like that I guess.